Hey y'all, Irix guy here, and I wanted to address a question. Hmm. Now that is good rum and coke. Uh, I want to address a question in regards to the video settings that I use for my Canon XA10 in conjunction with this thing right here. This is a Black Magic Intensity Extreme. So basically, I've got the HDMI going to the XA10 camera that that you can see me when you see me in the pink shirt right there. I'm, I'm being filmed by the XA10, which is connected to Blackmagic Design Intensity Extreme. And then I have the Thunderbolt cable running from the Blackmagic to my MacBook Air. And then I've got Sean Coonery, the most famous cat on the internet. Look at him. He said, I'm here and I will show you how to connect your XA10. And this is what I use. So a lot of my, my live broadcast, now these are the settings within Media Express, which is the Blackmagic application uh, that I use on the, uh, on the Mac. So my video format is HD 1080i 59.94. Capture file format is QuickTime Uncompressed 8-bit YUV. So those are the settings, and those settings were simply entered in uh, in Media Express Preferences, and there's the settings. Now, it took a while to find the best setting because this thing, uh, if it was just a little bit off, it would not work. And I know a lot of you have probably been plagued with the same uh, with the same, hopefully short-lived frustrations. But I know a lot of you have emailed me. And I decided to post this video response, and then that way you can share this with your friends. And also, if you don't have a Black Magic Intensity Extreme, like I said, that's what I'm using in conjunction with Thunderbolt on my MacBook Air. This is just the uh, the current model uh, MacBook Air. Doesn't have Retina or anything, nothing fancy. Uh, but now, let's see for the actual. Uh, for the chroma keying, so when I'm doing a live show on Iron Skies Adventure Channel, and you see my keyed in backdrops, etc., that's done within Cam Twist. So let me show you what I use within Cam Twist for settings. Hold on, my camera's about to power off. Okay, I had to push it. Uh, so the Cam Twist settings that I use are. And I'll just show you this in case you're curious about this too. Use 59 frames per second, 19, 20, 1080. And actually, I'm going to have to exit. So what I'll do so we can see Cam Twist, I've got to exit Media Express, which is Black Magic Program. So I exit it, and now I'm going to exit Cam Twist. Now I'm going to go back into Cam Twist. Actually, it's detecting my FaceTime HD. I think it's because I'm using, uh, let's just see here. Oh, here we go. So I did the New Year's Seated. I've, I've named a few of these. So if I open within Cam Twist my preview, you'll see there, there's my preview. And obviously I don't have everything keyed right now. But the settings that I use in Cam Twist are Blackmagic HD 1080i 59.948 bit. So obviously I can go over here and add and remove the chroma key effect. This is just a... Uh, if you've used Cam Twist, this is just a little preview window, so you can see you can you can uh, turn chroma key on and off, and, and likewise you can you can slide the threshold to minimize or to better uh, to better key in what you're trying to see. See, I'm taking away the green. I don't have any of my backgrounds. Here's what it is. But so you can see I set up these virtual sets. That's a desk. If I've got a set where I'm sitting way in the background, see? 
so you can key that out. Now you can see it's pretty much black. But that's that's a topic for another video. I just wanted to show you that yes, the Canon XA10 will work not only with Black Magic, but it'll also work with Cam Twist. So again, the uh, the Cam Twist preferences I had custom 1920 by 1080. But when I went to my webcam settings within Cam Twist, that's where I use Blackmagic HD 1080i 59.948 bit. Now, curiously enough, this version of Cam Twist is version 2.5. Now, I haven't updated it in a while, but I do know that there was a, a more current version that failed to cooperate with the XA10. I'm talking about Cam Twist, not Blackmagic. So anyway, I hope this video is a value. If if it is, you know, share it with others and and write me a good comment and say thanks. And if you don't like it, you know, I I still posted it, so I'm I'm proud that I posted it. Just another video on Irish Guys Adventure Channel. So thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash Irish Guy. Y'all have a good day.